46 years ago, NASA's Titan rocket launched from American soil. The Earth shuddered, and the rocket lifted off, sending plumes of fire and gas behind, as it pushed itself against Earth's gravity. Within a few minutes, it pierced through the sky, carrying a groundbreaking spacecraft, that would go on to create history, and be talked about even after four long decades. The day was September 5, 1977, and the spacecraft that the Titan rocket carried was Voyager 1. Voyager 1 is truly a trailblazer, it is a true representative of the audaciousness and tenacity of humans. It is our link to outer space, bringing the wonders that lay out there, hidden from our view, to our fingertips. Over the course of its more than 46-year journey, it has captured unbelievable and some exclusive images of the outer planets and their moons, in the process also capturing many hearts here on Earth. Today, we'll go on a voyage to see the many stunning discoveries this spacecraft has made, leaving scientists as well as the general public, awestruck. Welcome to Lab 360, it's time to explore. The Voyager 1 spacecraft has many firsts to its credit. It was the first space probe to image the moons of the gas giants Jupiter and Saturn in exquisite detail. Things we didn't even know existed were unveiled beautifully by this fascinating space probe. Continuing its journey even further, Voyager 1 left the region of influence of our Sun, and entered interstellar space on August 25, 2012, becoming the first spacecraft to do so. The extended mission of the Voyager 1 spacecraft is to stay true to its name, and continue its voyage beyond the icy boundaries of our solar system, bringing to us information about the marvels that lie yonder. As of January 2024, Voyager 1 is at a distance of 163 astronomical unit or AU from us, 1 AU being the distance between the Sun and the Earth. At that distance, it is the farthest object ever made by humans. Let's then, start our journey through the captivating discoveries the formidable Voyager 1 has made. Number 1. Jupiter's rings and its magnetosphere's extent. Voyager 1 reached Jupiter two years after its launch in January of 1979. Perhaps the most surprising discovery made by Voyager 1 is that Jupiter 2 has rings. Until then, only Saturn and Uranus were known to have rings. Voyager 1 was the one to find out that Jupiter 2 possessed a faint ring system, though definitely not as majestic as of our ring jewel, Saturn. Also, Jupiter's magnetosphere, which is the region of space where Jupiter's magnetic field dominates, is the second largest structure in our solar system after the Sun's heliosphere. It was studied extensively by Voyager 1. Voyager 1 was the first probe to find out that Jupiter's magnetosphere extends as far out as Saturn's orbit in some places. In this time-lapse sequence of Jupiter captured by Voyager 1, you can see the banded structure of Jupiter's atmosphere, with bands moving in opposing directions, creating storms at the intersections. Voyager 1 also discovered two small moons of Jupiter just outside its rings, Adrastea and Metis, making them the first moons of Jupiter to be discovered by a spacecraft. Today, Jupiter is known to have at least 95 moons. Number 2. Volcanoes on Jupiter's moon Io. The greatest surprise that was sprung up by the entire Voyager mission was probably the discovery of volcanic activity on one of Jupiter's moons, Io. It was the first time active volcanoes were seen on any other celestial body apart from Earth. The two Voyager space probes recorded the eruptions of a whopping nine volcanoes between themselves. Voyager 1 was around Jupiter till April 1979, and then continued its journey onward to Saturn. Then after studying the Saturn system, in 1981, Voyager 1 came out of the plane of the ecliptic, the plane in which all planets revolve around the Sun, to continue its journey onward towards the edge of our solar system. Number 3. Pale Blue Dot. 
Once it was out of the plane of the ecliptic, Voyager 1's planetary study phase came to an end. Carl Sagan, the famous American astronomer and science communicator, who was a part of the Voyager imaging team, lobbied NASA for a full 10 years to get the Voyager 1 spacecraft to turn its camera towards the planets and click one last picture, that of the planets, a family portrait of our solar system, from its vantage point above the ecliptic. Voyager 1's final image before its cameras were permanently switched off was indeed the family portrait of our solar system, which was taken on Valentine's Day in 1990. It shows the six planets Venus, Earth, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Two planets, Mercury and Mars could not be a part of the family portrait as Mercury was too close to the Sun to be seen, and Mars was hidden from Voyager 1's viewpoint. At the time this photo was taken, Voyager 1 was at a distance of 40 AU or 6 billion kilometers from us. Even the Sun was visible as no more than a point of light from that distance. This family portrait also contains one of the most iconic images ever clicked, that of Earth as the pale blue dot. Our Earth, in this image, appears no more than a tiny dot, suspended in a band of sunlight. The photograph inspired Carl Sagan to bring out his book of the same name in 1994, in which Sagan provides a poignant description of the photograph. That's here. That's home. That's us. On it, everyone you love, everyone you know, everyone you ever heard of, every human being who ever was, lived out their lives. The aggregate of our joy and suffering, thousands of confident religions, ideologies, and economic doctrines, every hunter and forager, every hero and coward, every creator and destroyer of civilization, every king and peasant, every young couple in love, every mother and father, hopeful child, inventor and explorer, every teacher of morals, every corrupt politician, every superstar, every supreme leader, every saint and sinner in the history of our species lived there on the moat of dust suspended in a sunbeam. The picture was a testimony to how far we had come, literally and figuratively. What's more, Voyager 1 continues its journey even today. Although its camera was powered off in 1990 itself, it continued to give data till as recently as November 2023 using its other instruments, after which it started sending unusable data. Now in a recent update on March 15, 2024, NASA announced some progress in trying to decode the data Voyager 1 was sending, and said that using that data to devise a possible solution, is something that will take time. Voyager 1 has inspired generations of people to savor the beauty of the stars and the cosmos that lay out there. From its vantage point, billions of kilometers away from us, Voyager 1 depicts the best of humanity, its resilience, its ambition, its courageousness, and its ingenuity. So what according to you tops the list of Voyager's mind-boggling discoveries? Share your thoughts in the comments section below. And be sure to subscribe to Lab360 for the latest revelations in space exploration. Hit the bell icon to stay updated, and let's continue to explore together.